I was just trying to tell Snapchat about something that happened and I was so upset that I couldn't even get my words out. So like maybe if I tell you, then I can actually like breathe and so I have a hard time understanding people. And I think it's because I have a hard time understanding myself and people call me unreasonable and like a lot of the times it's like the people that I'm dating and um it happened again yesterday <laughs> so um I I was um hanging out with a person that I was I've been dating um, or seeing uh, what is today Wednesday on Monday I was hanging out with them and my mom ca uh, called me or texted me and said hey can you um, can you come over and can you help me with some stuff I have a lot of stuff going on and I need some help um, is there any time this week that you'd be able to come over and I said yeah I'll come over on Tuesday and I'll help out and you know um, the person I was dating was like, um, after you go help your mom, are you going to come back or what are you going to do after you go help? And I was like, um, um, you know, well, l like, let me backtrack. So I, um, I told you guys, I went to my grandfather's, um, um, th uh, uh, family get together that we had for my grandfather's uh, service on Saturday and I've been um, because of that I think that um, I guess that doesn't make any sense I've been talking about Diablo Four for a really long time there's a game called Diablo 4 it came out and I've been wanting it and I really really have wanted it for a long time and um I played Diablo 3 I super loved it and the guy that I was dating came over to my house and I left and I went to and I've been talking about Diablo 4 I've posted it on Twitter I've t talked about it for a couple of weeks and um, mentioned it to him, mentioned it to plenty of people. And when I left to go to my grandfather's um, service and family thing, the guy that I was dating said that he had bought it for me and put it on my PlayStation here at my house. And when I then went to his house, I logged into my PlayStation account on his PlayStation and we were playing Diablo 4 and he said I I bought it for you it's at your house but we can play it here at my house and so for a few days we have been playing it and it was really fun and so when my mom asked me hey can you come and help me I said I'll come and help you but I want to come back to you know uh, I can either go home or I can come back and I want to play more Diablo 4 and I'll come back and we can play um, Diablo 4 like, you know. Um, so my mom said, you know, come help me on Tuesday. And the guy I was dating said, well, if you come back here, we can play Diablo 4. I really want you to come back. And um, um, that was the plan. And I've been struggling a lot with this ADHD medication. It makes it very hard for me to eat. Um, on top of the consistency of like taking it and all of the that stuff, um, my body really suffers like being on it. I um, have no appetite, so I have to remember to eat. Um, and uh, I feel nauseous a lot of the time. And um, that's just that's just gonna come with it so long story short um i'm leaving my mom's house yesterday and i text the guy i'm dating and i say hey i'm on, i'm on my way back and he he's like okay i'll see you soon and i'm about 
you know, 15 minutes from his house and he goes, what are you going to get for, uh, what are you hungry for? And I say a salad. Uh, he's like, what are you hungry for for dinner? I say a salad. And he goes, oh, okay. And I say, um, I don't know. I think I said something along the lines of like, did you want me to stop and get it? Uh, did you want me to stop and get us something? Um, since I'm already out. You know, just to be nice because I'm like, you're, you know, if you, um, um, there's like a situation at his parking in his, in his, um, with like the parking spaces and stuff. Like if you, if you get there too late in the day, there's no parking spaces. And it was already like seven o'clock at night. And, um, he texts me, he goes, Hey, um, uh, no, I'm, I already, or I'm not going to eat dinner or something like that, or I've already eaten. And so I'm like, Ugh, like, I'm not hungry. I want a salad. I'm nauseous. I don't want to stop. I'm like, ugh, like whatever. And then I get to his house and I'm like, there's no parking spaces. And I just start to totally spiral like, and I don't know if I was mad about any of it before I got there or I just got mad about it when I got there. Or I had been mad all day about something. I don't know, but like, it just, like, Oh, and another thing, mid midday when I was gone helping my mom, he texted me that he was playing Diablo. And I'm like, why when I'm out doing something, would you play the game that you bought for me? Why wouldn't you play like Call of Duty or like 2K or like, and then why would you text me and tell me that you're playing the game that you bought for me? Like, why would you be playing my game without me? Saying that, and then he said, I'm playing it because we were playing a boss level that we were both getting frustrated on. So I just wanted to beat it. And I'm like, that's not your reason. You wanted to do a thing because you can't deal with my emotion instead of, Hey, let's, Hey, I was wrong for making us go do a level that was past what we're capable of doing. So like, I shouldn't have done that. I'm just going to go and play the game that I bought for you by myself without you instead of just like playing call of duty or something else like it was like why would you do that so then i get there and i'm like and i start to spiral i'm like why did i come back here like you didn't buy me dinner there's no parking spot available for me so you didn't like you know i was coming for almost two hours like i drove back here sat and traffic for two two almost two hours of bumper to bumper traffic coming back here while you knew i was on the way back here for two hours and you didn't move your car it's not like you left to move your car to go get me food while you knew i was coming and all i wanted was a salad which is maybe like 10 bucks i don't know so it's like i just <laughs> and then it was like, it felt like you don't, like, in my, in, in my head, I'm like, it's like, you don't want me here. Like, you didn't want me here because you didn't provide food for me. You didn't, like, you didn't have anything for me to eat. You didn't have dinner. You didn't want me here. And then there's no parking space. You didn't provide a parking space or move your car and like, like, and it's just so, and so I'm like, Am I being unreasonable? Because then he called me unreasonable. And I'm like, I'm feeling gaslit. Like, I feel like, I feel like, I feel like, you know? He's like, you're asking, like, like, I feel like salad in a parking space is like asking for too much when I drove for like two hours. Like, I can treat myself better alone. 
and then so and it's cool i might be unreasonable you know what i mean like if if i am unreasonable if salad if if wanting someone to feed you after a long day if wanting someone to to like i guess right like it's my responsibility like i'm a grown up so i should feed myself but i just i want someone to care enough to feed me I want to be able to be lazy sometimes. I want to be able to go and take care of my mom and then come home and have somebody take care of me. To ask the bare minimum. To ask for just a salad. Because I could have came here to my house and I have stuff. Like, I have... I have a whole pizza, like, that I have bought. I could have thrown in the air fryer or something, you know? Like, I have stuff in my... Here. Um. So, it's like... If it is unreasonable, like, it might... It might be, but... I want it, I I want to be unreasonable sometimes because I want to I want to care f for s someone in that way too. Like I want them to be able to be unreasonable. Like And I just I can't I can't in my mind figure how it's like you when you know a parking situation is so hard like I went to grad school in long beach and there's like no parking right and then i live in the bay area now and parking spaces are so few and far between that it's like i just couldn't imagine living somewhere where you know parking's an issue and know that someone's coming to visit you and then not go out of your way to secure a parking space for them when you have hours to prepare right so then the kicker to this situation is I get home this morning because I went, um, I was there last night. Um, I get just like home this morning and I'm like, you know, let me play Diablo. Let me do something that's going to make me happy. I love this game. I had a rough day yesterday. I sat in bumper to bumper traffic for two hours and 45 minutes this morning let me play this game before i start work i turn on my playstation i turn on diablo and it's a in cart so i text him and i say so you didn't buy me diablo question mark why would you say that you did question mark and he say it's not on your game and i'm like no 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 why would you say that you bought me the game why would you say that you bought me the game he didn't buy it for me he bought it for himself <laughs> he bought it for himself and I was able to play it, but he didn't buy it for me. It's like, why would... Uh, it's, <laughs> when you like somebody, they can't lie to you and make you feel like they do stuff for you. Or they care about you. They... <laughs> I really thought that he had bought me Diablo. I was so excited. <laughs> so stupid. I really thought he bought it for me. But, um, he bought it for himself. <laughs> and then he's like, how was I supposed to buy it for you? Your credit card is not on the game, blah, blah, blah. It would have charged your, how was I supposed to, how was I? 
And I'm like, like, that's so dumb. Are you th like, you thought I wasn't gonna fight now or figure it out? Like, it's so dumb, like, to lie about something. And I, in my head, and I'm just like, How do you think any of anyone else online would buy it for me? They don't have my credit card info. They would have to buy it off of Amazon like anyone else. They would have to buy me a gift card from PlayStation gift card like anyone else. You're not special. Like, hello? Like, any other person would have to buy the game off of Amazon, would have to buy the game and gift it to me like anyone else. Like, the argument is so dumb and so stupid. All the things that he was saying. And I just, I saved my breath because it was like, he was sending messages after messages after messages and after messages. And I said, you know, I just don't, I didn't even respond to them. All I said was like, you know, I just honestly don't even care anymore because I was to, to save my breath. I don't want to teach somebody how to love me. And I don't want to tell somebody like, how do you think the rest of the internet would buy me a video game? <laughs> How do you think somebody in Timbuktu, Tennessee, and New York, and Maine, and Texas, how do you think they would buy me? How do you think if I'm asking someone to buy me a game, uh, buy me Diablo, how would they have to do it? Like, I'm so, I'm so dumb. I really thought somebody did something nice for me. Why would somebody do something like that? So like... Maybe I'm reasonable. I just don't understand why none of this happened. 